This question is from Gate Mechanical Engineering of 2012. This is question number 36. The question is for the matrix A given by 5133. Three, column entries are 5, 1 and second column entry are 3 and 3. One of the normalized eigenvectors is given as. So among these four options, we need to find one of the given eigenvectors. So first we need to find the eigenvalues. Okay, so we can use characteristic equation that is if this is matrix A, so A minus the eigenvalues, let's say lambda into the identity matrix, the determinant of this should be equal to 0. If we equate it to 0, we'll get the, this is the value of lambda which is the eigenvalues. So this, let's write 5 minus lambda, 3, 1, 3 minus lambda. This the determinant of this should be equal to 0 and from here we can get the two values of lambda as so 1 is 2 and 6 okay if we solve this we'll get 2 and 6 now we can find eigenvectors eigenvector okay so for eigenvalue lambda is equal to 2 let's find the eigenvector so a minus 2 iota into x should be equal to 0 okay now we can also write this as so let's write this matrix 3 1 3 1 okay this into x1 x2 is equal to 0 0 all right so this is how we can write from here if we solve this we'll get 3 x1 plus 3x2 is equal to 0 which means x1 is equal to negative x2 okay so these are the eigenvectors x1 and x2 so eigenvector will be eigenvector is 1 minus 1 okay and we need to find the normalized eigenvector right so first what we'll do we'll will find the modulus of this so this is 1 square plus negative 1 square okay so this is root 2 so we'll divide this eigenvector by root 2 and we'll get the normalized eigenvector okay so the required required normalized eigenvector so let's write normalized eigenvector will be equal to so 1 upon root 2 will be 1 upon root 2 and this will be minus 1 upon root 2. So this is our normalized eigenvector. So from here we can say option B is the correct choice. For more information you can refer to NPTEL course lecture number 46 Eigenvalues and Eigenvectors on Engineering Mathematics 1 by Professor Jitendra Kumar of the Department of Mathematics at IIT Kharagpur.